Echoes of History, Understanding the Phrase Hello everyone, and welcome to today's English learning video. In this session, we're going to explore the phrase, Echoes of History. This is a fascinating phrase that appears in various forms of English literature, speeches, and everyday conversations. Understanding it will not only enhance your English skills but also give you a deeper appreciation of how language can capture complex ideas. So, let's dive in. The phrase, echoes of history, is a metaphorical expression. An echo is a sound that is repeated or reverberates after the original sound has stopped. When we use this phrase in English, we're comparing historical events or their impacts to these reverberating sounds. It implies that the effects or influences of past events are still being felt in the present. This phrase is often used to draw a parallel between something happening now and similar events from the past. To better understand echoes of history, let's look at some examples. 1. Literature. In literature, an author might use this phrase to draw connections between their story's events and real historical events. 2. News and journalism. Journalists often use this phrase when current events closely resemble or are influenced by past events. 3. Everyday conversation. In daily talks, People might refer to echoes of history when discussing how past family events or traditions influence their current life. Understanding phrases like echoes of history is crucial for several reasons. It enhances your comprehension of English, especially in more advanced and nuanced contexts. It helps in understanding the cultural and historical references that English speakers often make. It allows you to appreciate the poetic and metaphorical use of language in English. I hope this video has helped you understand the phrase, echoes of history. Remember, English is full of such beautiful and meaningful expressions, and learning them can be both enlightening and enjoyable. If you like this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe for more content. Happy learning, and see you in the next video.